Yo, what up guys, Exiles and X, how are you guys doing today? So welcome back to this PC tutorial on how to get the Dramora Lord working on the Xbox 360. So a lot of people have been having a lot of difficulties with, and I really don't understand why. If you can't read the README, well, you should be reading the README, that's kind of the point. So, I've downloaded the file, I'm going to put it on my desktop somewhere secure, type in the password, Xiles and X, lowercase, no spaces. Right, close down that, open up this folder, I'm going to pick the... Uh, I think we'll start in the house. So, I don't know, pick, yeah, house start, yeah, come on. I'm going to drag that save game over to my desktop, or the data file anyway. I'm going to take a look at the README, that's the whole point. Now, it says, this ROR contains a save game that, please put that in your save game. So, when you load it up on that and you get an STFS package saying it does not work, obviously, you want to put your save game on your desktop. Now, I put mine in the recycling bin, so I'm going to drag that back out. It will be an auto save, okay? That's my one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag that into Horizon. Okay, I've null the identifications to stop theft, but as you can see, that is the complete ID and identification. What you're going to want to do is put that in there. That is a very simple job, guys. It is as simple as this. Click, rehash and resign, save to device. It's as simple as that, guys. This has been Exiles and X. Until my next video, I'm out. Peace!